in this video i will show how to create a time series chart using microsoft power bi so uh, let me navigate to the data tab so that i can show you the data which i'll be using to create the time series chart so this is the sample super sort data which i will be using to create the time series chart so we have multiple date columns like order date ship date i can use any of those in the x axis and in the y axis i will use some measures which power bi has already calculated that we can see on the report tab so uh, see we have multiple measures like sales quantity discount profit etc uh, now let me go back to the report and here we'll be creating the time series chart so uh, the basic thing is time series chart is basically line chart so uh, what we are trying to analyze here is the variation of certain measures along with time so the first thing is I have clicked on the line chart icon which is shown on the visualization pane uh, so now we have the line chart uh, box showing inside the report pane now what I can do is I can expand this order table then from here I can see we have a column called as order date so power by a itself is intelligent enough to identify what which is the year quarter month and day from the date column what we have in the data so from here now what i can do is see i'm not going to pull any specific year quarter month or day i am going to pull the entire order date which consists of uh, date month and year so i'm going to pull this order date into x-axis so now we have order date in x-axis the next thing is y axis so here i'm going to pull some measure so uh, let me take y sales into y axis first so let me see yeah see now oh, what we are seeing here is uh, sum of sales with respect to the order date which means in each of the order date what is the uh, total sales happening so now if I want to compare the profit also uh, then I can pull profit also into y axis and I'm going to pull profit also into y axis so now we have s we have a second uh, measure yep now this chart does not look very good now so what I'm going to do is I'm going to filter this data uh, let me filter this data so I'm going to filter this based on an year. I'm going to take only single year. That is 2019. And I'm going to take basic filtering. I don't want advanced filtering here. So I just wanted only 2019. So now this chart looks better because now we have more visibility into each of the months earlier we did not have that kind of a visibility so this is basically how we create a time series line chart using microsoft power bi we have multiple options here i'm not going to explore all the options here uh, this is how we create a simple most simple basic time series line chart using power bi thank you